All right, what's up, guys? Um, so today I'm going to do a review. The angle's kind of weird. I don't know where my tripod is, so I'm gonna have to buy a new one. But that's cool. It gives me an excuse to uh, buy a really awesome tripod. Anyway, so I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna review some uh, Zanchis. This is a regular, just 57 millimeter Zanchi. Basically, the standard. This is really nice. This is my Camkeeper Zanchi that I've modded, similar to the kind of like 48 point edge mod. I I swapped the cord to keep view, and now it's just like ridiculous. So that's definitely is gonna be my main for a long time now. But anyway, I wanted to I'll show you guys three new cubes that I'm going to show you from biggest to smallest yeah so they get smaller <coughs> so you got your standard Zanchi here and I just acquired one from iCube Mart from Jeffrey which is really awesome so it is the 55 millimeter okay so go ahead and open this I like to keep my boxes nice so I always open it up like that I'm gonna show you the difference yeah very little difference so if you check this out it's literally about two millimeters less. So 57, 55. What I've noticed with this one is it's actually like almost perfect for, you know, one-handed cubing. Um, I'm not the greatest one-hand cuber, but I can still get like 29, 39 second solves sometimes, depending on which cases I get <laughs> and no. But this is definitely my favorite for one-hand cubing. And there's not much else to say about it. I mean, these are just different size Zanchis, but the pieces are casted exactly the same, just miniature versions. And they feel just like Zanchis. Sticker qualities are the same. They're really nice. And the pieces are a little bit kind of odd. You can tell these are a little bit more rectangle than the, the, squ the square corners, but it could just be an illusion with the stickers. Yeah, that one's really, 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 really nice. So the next step, down. I just wanted to give you guys um, my first impressions with these things is oh wait wait before I open it before I open it my bad is a 50 millimeter Diane this is still just a Zanchi just gonna go ahead and open that ready for the size difference <laughs> really nice and small so as you can see it goes from 57 to 55 to 50 so you can see where those five millimeters are. Um, they're pretty accurate, actually. I'm not gonna pull out a straight edge and measure it, but you can see the difference. Uh, this one's really good for small hands or like really young cubers just getting into it. I don't know why, this one fits my girlfriend's hands perfectly, but she really likes the mini for some reason. I think it's just because it fits nice in her little uh, purse or something. So females out there, this one's probably perfect for you because regardless of its size, it's still just as awesome and in performance and cutting and everything as the main Zanji. So you can see this one just it's just ridiculously fast, doesn't doesn't pop anything. It's just perfect travel size cube. And whenever my girlfriend doesn't have it in her purse, I have it on me. <laughs> so uh, sticker quality, the same thing. This one has a little bit of bubbles, but you know, those are the only bubbles on the whole cube. But you can see that it still has kind of that little bit of rectangular shape compared to the square corners. I'm not sure if it's just a sticker illusion or not because the pieces seem like the same size. But then again, the center looks a little bit bigger than these. I'm not sure. Regardless, it doesn't matter. It's a nice little cube. Now, the next cube owner view is even smaller. Wait, that's not it. <sighs> that's the one. Okay, so this one is the 42 millimeter, and I have pretty big hands, but look at this. Look how small that is. It's just ridiculous. So let's go ahead and open this. Yes, this is the stickerless version of the cube. It has the same Diane logo. Oh, actually, like this, I should show you. And pieces are casted exactly the same as this. So there really isn't much to say about its uh, little brother, except for the fact that this one performs just as good as this one. It's, it's almost just mind-blowing. It really was when I first saw it. And a lot of other people at Nationals, including uh, Ro, <laughs> followed me to buy one because they were just so cool. Yeah, this is a little, the little guy. To me, I have a little bit bigger fingers, so it's a little bit tough to cue, but you can see that they still, you know, perform just as well. They cut just as good. Uh, yeah, so uh, if you're trying to train your dog how to how to cube, you can buy one of these. No, I'm just joking. These are really awesome. I think it's one of my favorite travel cubes because it looks like a keychain. looks kind of interesting to people who, who, are, who are just watching you cube and are just fascinated. And, I mean, this thing could fit in the smallest little pocket ever. And you won't have to worry about stickers being messed up in the pocket with this one. It's just a stickerless. So, yeah, it's the same exact little thing. So, without the main size Zanchi, these are the three that I'm showing you guys. And they are all very awesome. There's not much to say about them. They perform, act, and feel just like regular Zanchis, but they're just smaller. So guys, find your right size and go pick one up over at iCube Mart. Check them out. Highly recommend them. And for those who've been emailing me, you guys have said you were like 10 to 12 just starting into speed cubing. Don't in my opinion, don't listen to people who say that these cubes are going to be too fast for you because they're not. It's better to get started on one of these and stick with it through your whole cubing career, in my opinion, than to start with other cubes and keep buying, 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 and then you get to this one. I started my girlfriend on this exact cube, and two weeks later, she's already submitting. So there's none of that beginner cube stuff that should uh, matter in this whole situation. So that's it, guys. I'm running out of footage, and that's really all I need to say about these things. Check out the 55, 50, and 42 millimeter Zanchis out there. I'm sure there's 42 millimeter 
your black cubes also. So that's it guys, I hope you have a good one. Um, these are my first impressions or just me, my little first thoughts on these things. I will review these individually and go over the different points on each one and the way the pieces are made and whatnot. And then I'll make separate videos for all three and you'll get to see the internals for all of them. So stay tuned for those. If you don't know how to stay tuned, you just gotta subscribe and that's it. Alright guys, peace. Have a good one.